Hey guys, so today's video is going to be my pamper routine and I pretty much do this whenever I've had a long day or feeling stressed or just want to relax. Um, so I probably do this a few times a month. So I start by drawing a bath and why is it called drawing a bath? I don't know. But that is what I do. So I get the water ready and then I like to add something to the water. Uh, today I was using a Lush bath bomb. This one's called the Experimenter. And when I went to Lush, I just asked for one that looked cool when you put it in the water. Um, so it does look super cool when you put it in the water, but then it ends up leaving your water like a dirty color, so it was okay. I don't think I'd repurchase it. Then I like to get my hair out of my face before jumping into the bath, so I end up with a sweet hairstyle, something like this. And if I'm feeling extra fancy, I will light a candle. This one is Mahogany Teakwood from Bath & Body Works. It smells super good. Then I like to wash my face and I just picked up the Murad Clarifying Cleanser from Sephora. Um, I've heard good things about it. And then I'm applying a face mask and this is Origins Clear Improvements. Moving on to exfoliating, I either use the Rubber Rub Shower Scrub from Lush, which is a salt-based scrub, or if you want to use a body wash as an exfoliant, these gloves are super great. I got them from shoppers. I think you can get them from like most drugstores. And they're super cheap, so you just put them on and then use your body wash as normal. So this is the Olay Age Defined Body Wash. And I love using this one with the exfoliating gloves because it's super moisturizing. It also has vitamin E in it and the lather is just very creamy. So it's great to use since exfoliating is pretty drying to the skin. Kind of combats that and it leaves your skin super smooth and moisturized. And then for shaving, I'm using the Gillette Venus Violet Swirl Shaving Cream and the Venus Swirl Razor. And I really like this one because it has a flexi ball, so it's easier to get around your knees and ankles without cutting yourself, which I tend to do pretty often. So just lathering up that leg and then shaving. And then the best time to moisturize is after having a bath or a shower, and especially if you've shaved your legs, it's really important to moisturize. So I'm using the Seabooth 4-in-1 Moisturizing Lotion. I think it smells super good, and it does the job. And then by now it's probably time to take off the face mask. This one takes a while to wash off. Uh, it's a lot easier if you use like warm or kind of hot water. And then I just pat my face dry and time to apply some skincare. So I'm using the Alouette Be Smooth All-in-One Balm. This is a very thick and kind of greasy moisturizer. So I like to use it before I go to bed or if I know I'm gonna be home for a while because it takes a while to sink into the skin, but it feels so good on your skin and it's anti-aging, smoothing, and just super nice. And then I'm trying to use eye creams more often. It's something I kind of overlook. This is the Mega Bright one from Origins. And lastly, I like to hydrate my lips, so here I'm just using a Vaseline. So now that I'm feeling all clean, smooth, and hydrated, don't you just feel so good after having a bath or shower? Oh my, you can see my butt cheeks, sorry about that. <laughs> uh, so I like to just relax and have some sort of hot beverage. This is the matcha green tea latte from, oh, uh, where's this from? This is from Trader Joe's. So you basically just add, I think it's three or four tablespoons to hot water. Mix it up and then you have a little green tea latte. So then I just relax and either go on my laptop or watch TV or something. So that is my pamper routine. Hopefully you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys all in my next video.